the unrest in Zingwicha, a town in southern Senegal, came one day before the expected start of Sonko's rape trial in the country's capital, Dakar. Sonko was tried based on a woman's accusations that he assaulted her when she worked at a massage saloon. If convicted, Sonko faces up to 10 years in prison and would be banned from running for president. According to the local authorities, a police armored vehicle struck and killed the officer as it was reversing. The government offered condolences to the officer's family, calling his death a tragic accident. Clashes occurred near Sonko's home, where he has been staying while vowing to defy any summons to appear in Dakar for the rape trial. Sonko challenged President Macky Sall in Senegal's 2019 presidential election and was elected mayor of Zongwitcher last year. Supporters gathered outside his home starting Sunday evening, fearing police would move to arrest him to bring him to court. Messages have circulated on social media calling for supporters to act as Sonko's shields and defend their leader from arrest. Sonko recently received a six-month suspended prison sentence in a defamation case and declared he would no longer respond to court summons without his safety being guaranteed. His lawyers told reporters at a news conference in Paris on Monday that Sonko had not yet received a summons but would appear in if, the, uh, if conditions were met. Senegalese police deployed extra officers in Zingwicha and elsewhere in Senegal. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.